Welcome back to the Crypto Org. This is Jay giving you some updated cryptocurrency news for the beginners. Uh, before I get started, I just want to say that nothing in my video is financial advice, so please uh, do your own research on the research that I present to you in this video. So, before I get started with the actual presentation, I'm going to remind you guys that in the link descri in the description below, there is a free report in the top five scalable crypto projects. So if you have not gotten your feet wet with cryptocurrency yet and don't know where to start looking, definitely take advantage of this because these crypto projects have their own growing ecosystem and they are pretty hot in DeFi. And, you know, Cardia Chain is bringing the DeFi summer back. Uh, base, yeah, because last year, DeFi basically um, rocketed and they want to do the same thing for this uh this year and they have quite a lot of um, initiatives as well and I'm gonna show I'm gonna be showing you that so once again yeah check the description below for this free report all you need to do is just put in your email and it'll be sent there all right okay so 48 laws of power it's just a quote so the attention you attract must never offend or challenge the reputation of those above you not at any rate if they are secure you will seem not only paltry, but desperate by comparison. There is an art knowing when to draw notice and when to withdraw. When to do that is totally up to you guys. All right, so <laughs> DeFi summer. So yeah, once again, last year and on uh, summertime, all the DeFi, oh, not all the DeFi projects, but a majority of the DeFi projects were getting a lot of traction. One of them was like Ave going from like a dollar in August and all of a sudden going to thousands of dollars within just like two to three months. And that was insane. I wish I had um, jumped in on that, but you know what, I can't catch everything. But anyways, Cardi Chain is hoping to bring that hype back this summer with their own initiatives as well. Um, so this was their post a couple days ago. DeFi Summer. Now the reason why you want to pay attention with Cardia Chain is because they're they're very quick, low transaction cost, and like I said, it's very quick and also they're very secure as well. And yeah, I've used their Kydex, their decentralized exchange, and it's so smooth, man. Uh, you can have access to it uh, through their um, D app, their Cardia Chain wallet. So you definitely want, don't want to miss in ah miss with Cardia Chain's ecosystem. I don't know why I can't talk right now. But anyways, um, these are the hottest pools. This is DPET. Definitely pay attention to this. I'm gonna show. I'm gonna be showing you some price action on this guy. Uh, this is their the Korean dollar. Anyway, stable coin. This and that. Now, if you take a look at the APRs. You can see that it's quite high. The only reason why it's high is because not many people are touching it right now. So definitely do take advantage of Biko or DFL. DPET is the one that I'm aiming for right now. Why? It's because um, these NFTs, these pets, gaming in general is going to basically skyrocket. Because a lot of people are going to be playing games. And also, these games, they earn money. So you can basically have people uh, hired on the side and then they can basically... Uh, do the thing for you and then you know make passive income that way and remember that is not financial advice any sort of way you got to do your own research and understand the game yourself so let's take a look at what other things cardi chain is doing so to follow their expansion in indonesia their head of marketing astrid cardia is doing an ama uh discussing about their partnership with tocoin uh, i looked in tocoin uh, not too deep but this is what they have. So, uh, Tocoin is a blockchain based cryptocurrency platform that establishes identity and reputation for MSMEs to access the business solution. I'm just going to be straight up with you guys. I don't know what MSME is. I didn't even bother. You know, let me take a look. I should do my own due diligence of re researching these things prior to. Uh, Ministry of Micro and Small and Medium Enterprises. Okay, okay. So they're, in a way, they're kind of like platforms. So 
In terms of business solutions, um, they do have a POS system as well as some tracking. So this is it. This is their website, tocoin.io. I don't know why it says BIT. Welcome to BIT. Indonesia's first blockchain innovative ecosystem where blockchain becomes the problem solution uh, for businesses and a way of life. So this is Tocoin. Tocoin is a blockchain-based platform with a mission to build uh, digital profiles, digital bookkeeping, access to business support institutions through Tocoin's mobile applications that are ready to advance your business and your life. So when it comes to digital bookkeeping and also digital profiles, uh, they are pushing towards that thing with a digital ID. Basically, it's um, one entire ID to basically show all your different stats, like your vaccinations and all those other things. Um, even though it's not, it didn't get passed yet here in uh, Ontario, uh, they are developing that narrative towards it because they are going to push it there. Man. They want to track everyone. Now, in terms of Tocoin, um, they are building the infrastructure for a lot of businesses. So this project is really good because now newer businesses in the emerging markets or developing countries can now apply their technology to basically um, what I call it, transition their business from the old legacy system to the blockchain network. So anyway, this is this is amazing. Good, great for mass adoption. And also they have a POS system, point of sale, super application based on blockchain technology that makes it easier to manage your business transaction, which is good. And they also have their own supportive wallets as well, which is definitely A plus because, you know, when it comes to wallets, you got to protect your asset. There's a saying that if it's not your keys, it's not your crypto. So guys, keep your crypto safe, put in a wallet, whether it's soft software wallet that you can download for free or a hard wallet like a ledger trezor uh decent i don't know what other hardware wallets are out there but um if you are looking to a hardware wallet i recommend ledger uh, i've been using the product since last year and i've had no issues if you do want the link to the ledger look in my description below and the link should be right there if you do go through my link you do get a free offer such as a free $25 voucher as well as a free cryptocurrency guide. So if you're new to crypto, definitely take advantage of that. So yeah, that is Tocoin for you. Bit by bit. Oh my God. Their website is really slow, man. Not gonna lie. There's too many things going on. That or my computer's too low. I mean, it's slow. But anyways, that is Tocoin, one of their new partnership. And other than that, they also have Live Trade, which is basically another platform to do exchanges, farming, staking, repo, and DIPOs. And when it comes to tokenization, they are taking uh, advantage of that as well. They're doing their own thing. And when it comes to stock markets, real estate, basically anything in the real world, everything is getting tokenized. And you can see that the Cardia chain ecosystem is moving towards that as well. So they're clearly making moves, guys. Now, when it comes to Cardia chain, it's kind of like V chain as well. They're going for many, many different industries. So basically, they're going for world domination as well. Uh, I, I haven't used this yet, to be honest, but definitely want to pay attention to this because it's in the Cardia chain ecosystem. And Cardia chain alone is a behemoth all by itself. And I definitely do believe that this is. Super undervalued. It's I think it's around like five cents right now. Uh, you know what? We'll take a look at it after. All right. So my DeFi pet. Those of you that don't know, with these pets, you can basically train them like as if uh, it's a Tamagotchi. You can breed them. They can evolve, and soon we'll be able to basically battle these pets and earn yield. Uh, there, it hasn't come out yet, but my DeFi pet is. Barely new. It's only been like uh, two months or probably like a month old. But anyways, this is the current price right now, $5. A couple days ago, I think it was around like July 13. This thing was worth like in the price range I wanted to buy in. Hey, <laughs> look at that. Less than two bucks and all of a sudden it just rallied all the way to like six, almost six dollars. That's going back up again, probably retesting its old highs. Um... 
this is one of the coins that I want to get in. Um, my, my brother and I are already talking about it, and he says he's going to maintain uh, the team for me. So I'm really going to take advantage of that because why? It's free passive income, guys. So, yeah, this is um, my DeFi pet for you. Um, do I see a correction happening? Yeah, you know what? It could. I could correct somewhere around here, $3.10. Uh, I'm not much of a trader and uh, I don't see the volume uh, going down anytime soon. I mean, like, it did go down a bit, but based on decentralized finance as well as gaming, I do not see this, like, going straight down to, like, $2 yet. I think it's going to well, go up a little bit more, especially when they come up with their PvP platform. Oh, my God. This is going to rip it. Like, probably, like, 25 bucks for Axie Infinity is. Let's take a look at Axie Infinity. Axie. Oh boy. That's not in. Oh boy. Axie Infinity. All right. So this is. Oh my God. Just a couple days. Oh, weeks ago. I think it was just two weeks ago. Yeah, oh my god, it was just two weeks ago. Earlier this month, guys, this was up five bucks. All right, and now it's trading around $26. So you can see just how big gaming is going to be, guys. And when it comes to Axie Infinity, yeah, these are pets that you can basically battle and now make money out of it. And one of my good friends, he's on this, and he already has, like, multiple teams. So this guy's, like, making multiple passive incomes. And that's what you should be doing, too, my honest opinion. And that is not financial advice. But anyways, if you can't make money during your sleep, you know what? You're always going to be chasing money. And you know what? You're just going to get old, and sooner or later, you're going to slow down. So... Find a way to make money work for you guys. That way it's less stressful in your life. All right, so uh, let's see. The Kai token has also been listed in the Indodax. So in terms of adoption-wise, this is good because now it opens more gates for people to acquire the actual coin. So I'm very bullish in this actual pick. I have it staking right now in the Cardi Chain wallet, and I will not take it out. So in other news, we do have PayPal increasing their crypto payment limits for their U.S. customers. Uh, PayPal has ra raised cryptocurrency limits for U.S. customers to 100000 per week without an annual purchase limit, according to the company. Now, this is definitely great mass adoption news because PayPal, they have a big list of customers. And also, these guys were in on a lot of things way, way before um, they were actually involved when it comes uh, to blockchain development as well as cryptos. Um, I don't have the actual videos of it, um, but you know what? In later videos, I will bring it up so that way you guys can see. And when it comes to PayPal, guys, there's a lot of big names behind it, like Peter Thiel. Peter Thiel is behind or supporting a lot of crypto projects. One of them being is RSR. So look into RSR. It's around two cents right now. So, and I think, let's see, it's all the highs were around 13 cents. So, in my opinion, it's heavily undervalued. And it's one of those things that's going to be in Coinbase as well and other than PayPal. So, look into RSR. All right, let's get some other mass adoption news. Visa is now partnering with over 50, 50 crypto companies to allow clients to spend and convert digital currencies. So that is good. Now more and more people can acquire cryptocurrency. Uh, so despite them saying all these different FUDs about cryptocurrency, don't listen to those big guys. Because in the back end, they are buying out um, crypto exchanges as well as yeah, putting their money into crypto as well. Uh, keep in mind too that more than a billion uh, was spent on crypto linked visa cards well they're only in the first half of 2021 so in the second half of 2021 expect this to go up even more and this bull run is not over yet guys like many I mean like the previous bull runs after a big dip 
like we what we just had or probably go down even more it always does a rally back up and towards the end of the year I think Bitcoin is going to reach around like 150,000 um, Willy Wu one of the top crypto traders he's saying that it can go between 200 to 300,000 uh, I don't have the data to basically show you that. I'll probably show you that in tomorrow's video. But uh, when it comes to crypto, guys, it's here to stay. It's not going anywhere at all. And this is in terms of the new economy. Blockchain solution is the future. And crypto is going to be dancing all over it. Now, that is all I have for you in this video. If you did find this somewhat informative, please do press that like button. Also, share this information around as well because other people are going to need to know about crypto as well as get into the right crypto projects and not these scammy projects like these uh, meme coins. And let's see, what else? Also, press that subscribe button as well and press that notification bell button so you get notified when I come up with the next video. And yeah, oh, also, yeah, don't forget, uh, take advantage of that free report. Remember, it's in the description below. And yeah, that's all I have. Thank you so much for listening. Take care.